Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome to the probably last video of this season for ranked. Hey, hey, what's up, guys? This is Green from the Future again. I was editing the video right now and I noticed that, uh, yeah, everything I said in the beginning was wrong because this morning everything changed and uh, the season got extended for one week. So we will definitely have one or two more, at least one or two more uh, ranked gameplay videos, blah, blah, blah. Um, so, yeah, I recorded this video yesterday evening. So that's why. I didn't get the information yet, but yeah. Just so that you know, this will not be the last ranked video. Okay, let's go. Because like, I think it's in two days, the season is over. And honestly, I don't know if I will push even further. I'm at 8,700 now. I know it's just a small tiny bit until I have the 9,000, but I just don't know if I have the, the strength to do it now. And uh, I don't know, the, the decks I have in mind right now are not very good applicable um, because yeah I will not just randomly try to learn a new deck now in just a few hours and probably get super destroyed so yeah maybe we'll just end it at 8700 but it's fine I'm still at the moment uh, rank 5 in Europe rank 7 in the world or so so yeah a good ranking I cannot complain about it um, it was good for the first season happy about it but for the f next season, I will definitely need to learn other decks. I will, uh, I will definitely come up with new decks. Um, very happy for next season. So next week, the new season begins. So immediately, we will try to push immediately in the beginning, and then also, um, yeah, do some videos about it. Also with new decks, we'll test a lot. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Um, yeah, now I will show you some of my videos of my, my last ranked gameplay videos. I hope you enjoy it and um, yeah, let's jump into it. Okay, so let's go. This was one of my last games I did. This time not with Newt, but with Neville. <laughs> Usually I'm a Newt player, so uh, yeah. I'm not a huge Neville player, but yeah, sometimes you need to do it, especially with the banning uh, deck system. So you will see this deck, honestly, is kind of boring. You will see it. Because what I basically do, it's not a real Neville spawn uh, deck. Well, not spawn, but like, you know, uh, egg and unicorn and stuff like that. It's a little bit more different. It's more super defensive, let's say it like that. But you will you will just uh, see it once, the, once we have the board cleared. You can already see it with the first cards. It's, yeah, maybe not the classical Neville deck. Um, I honestly, it was also not my idea, the deck. I copied it from another player and I was like, okay, this looks kind of fun. It's something different. So, yeah. Honestly, also, I have um, been noticing the last few days, my biggest weakness is that I don't move enough. Here I move a kind of decent amount, but very often, also in duo, I noticed that I just don't move enough and I definitely need to improve that. In the beginning of the new season um, it should be not a problem it's not something crazy but uh, yeah so Cassandra without a doubt one of the strongest and most annoying companions I mean you see here she's still surviving she's still surviving he needs to go back because otherwise he gets way too much damage and she's still surviving because I heal her up the whole time so it can be a real pain to deal with her um, you also see here in a lot of decks and well my Cassandra with the echo she gets boosted to level 8 which is crazy 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 high and even his Cassandra with um, level 5 is yeah kinda annoying and uh, even here she didn't immediately die if I'm not uh, wrong okay she immediately died <laughs> whatever but um, yeah you will see now it looks like that I'm not really ahead that I'm probably behind but you will shortly see that we will gain control of the board and you already see all his units are dead because yeah he had the Malfoy gang and Malfoy gang once one of them is dead the whole uh, gang goes away walks away so yeah here we uh, spawn our crabs and more heal look at all the heal 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 so it's very annoying because he doesn't have a lot of spells if you have a lot of spells you can definitely deal way better with it but yeah you see no chance for him no chance for him and um, yeah everything just gets destroyed yeah yeah I think he has two spells if I um, paid, paid uh, this amount of attention and um, you see his health 
was just down because uh, the centaurs the whole time, um, the big two, the two big boys, uh, Lokomoto, also uh, did a decent amount of damage. And you see they're still here alive. Uh, Daniel, I'm just giving heal, 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 a centaur. And uh, yeah, we are almost back <laughs> to our next companion. There he is. So um, yeah, he was just struggling to really like create a board because he, he, he used spell on us. Uh, he should ju he, honestly, he should just have tried to build a big push. That would have been a better win condition for him because I just had one spell. Maybe he would have won with it, but in the end, it was just too much stuff for him to 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 handle everything and. Uh, yeah, so for me it was basically just a waiting game at that point. I was like, okay, we'll just chill, just play my stuff, stay in the background, and yeah. Is this one of the best Neville decks? Definitely not, no. It can be kind of good against, like, for example, a deck like his. It can be very good, but they are way, way, way better Neville decks, without a doubt. Okay, okay, so let's jump into the next game. This is also a player I, pl I played a lot of times against him. Um, yeah, I'm not even sure in which team he is, if he is my team or not, but uh, yeah, whatever. So he, he's a little bit higher than me, but that has n nothing to say, right? I mean, yeah, of course, it gives you a little bit more room to take damage, right? It's obviously uh, always good to have more health, but in the end you can also win, right? Even without... Um, being super pay to win let's say it like that or being super high right so yeah here i was already super scared because i was like oh no oh no i will lose my cassandra super early and uh, yeah sadly indeed i lost her super early so usually that's a very bad sign because cassandra is not super easy to handle she can be crazy annoying especially with enough heal and yeah here also another thing he pushed my units the whole time totally to the back you, you will see it in the end how it will look like but um yeah here he uh, also gave me very great value and i was already like "Ooh, this will be very hard i <laughs> i really didn't think that i could win and here again he just uh, killed my centaur i didn't have any unit on the board so i was like oh okay. honestly at that point i didn't really believe in a possible win but here he kind of failed the spell because i think he also wanted to have the locomotives um in the spell range but yeah and here we just like totally healed everything a little bit and went and here the the the, the let's just say <laughs> we started to build a sim city or so right it's like a building simulator you see we have already our two buildings and it will get more so yeah let's say this is the third building it's just like spam with another spam here he's healing and honestly i didn't really think a lot about the self-healing i i forgot how it, it's it's called sorry um Yes, I have watched all the Harry Potter movies, but sometimes I just forget the names of the spells or some cards, and so I'm, I'm sorry about it, okay? Uh, also, not saying that I'm the biggest Harry Potter fan. I like Harry Potter, I watched all the movies, but yeah, obviously there are way, way bigger Harry Potter fans than I am. There are definitely a lot of questions I could not answer. And here, <laughs> that's kind of annoying with Ron. But yeah, so now everything was uh, in another place. It didn't change a lot honestly but yeah and you see we we finally gained the momentum we started to build a little push um the yeah, health wise he was still in the lead and at that point i was yeah i was still thinking okay it will be very hard because he has a lot of spells i mean with harry um it can be kind of annoying with the with the cheap spells and everything but uh, you will just see how it ended. Um, obviously, I lost also a lot of games uh, pushing uh, or playing ranked without a doubt. I uh, will just not show the losers here because it's a little bit boring. You will gain nothing from it. 
I did a ton of misplays and often I lost because like the matchup was just very bad and it is what it is or uh, I played a few times against a ranked one player which is one of the highest players also in uh, China, Taiwan whatsoever so he just destroys most of the people here it's obvious if you have like if you're an experienced player that already played two years you will not just win randomly against him right I started playing this game three weeks ago so that's super normal and yeah uh, I'm sure in a few weeks or months I will be like wow I played so bad when I watched this kind of videos obviously right it's just the beginning it's the beginning um, in the probably near future we'll have the global release so way more players and everything will change and here yeah at one point we, I was just like okay I need to overwhelm him overwhelm him with units and yeah that's how we won let's go into one more game okay okay so here I'll play against white 2115 also one of the highest players in the world obviously I mean most of them are in the in this uh, games here he's currently number two Hufflepuff I'm number one but this could change I, th I mean it's very likely that he takes the number one spot back uh, also good player um, but you will just see how the game goes um, yeah so at that point I'm honestly uh, saying that I didn't really have an idea what what he's playing right but then I realized okay it's Snape and uh, Snape can be honestly a good counter to spam because yeah, obviously he does more damage so it is usually a good echo against spam one of the better ones I would say um, but yeah with Newt I'm always just like okay depending on situation I just need to push to do pressure and yeah the the fog it's not called the fog but you know what I mean the fog here is such a strong card a lot of people play it honestly and um, yeah it's very effective also get against spells can stun the storm and stuff like that um, yeah health wise we were definitely in the lead and uh, I was luckily very happy about it but here oh yeah yeah that combination is really really annoying thunderstorm and uh, her mind companion so it's super important to kill her as fast as possible so he cannot just cast another spell on you or she cannot cast another spell on you um, yeah here we just need to walk away because he does like way more damage and um, yeah obviously the idea behind it was not too bad but in the end it's just not enough pressure I mean um, it is what it is yeah the fog the fog the fog here he took it a little bit more defensively yeah I don't know it's just his deck is maybe okay in some cases but I personally am not a big fan of it against spam well no chance he didn't have like big big spells to clear everything and yeah sadly for him I mean I played a few times against him I won every time I think the last game I lost against him uh, because he finally realized he needed to ban my new deck but yeah before I played a few times against him one and he never banned my new deck it was <laughs> kind of his own fault because uh, he doesn't really have very very good decks to counter you let's say it like that um, it got a little bit closer than needed but yeah he was also almost out of, yeah I hear I missed the the thing the the pig you know what I mean <laughs> this is also total misplay I I have no clue I just misclicked and it almost cost me the game it almost cost me the game so uh, yeah <laughs> as you can see very very close but sometimes it just at 1 HP or 2 HP it win you the game luckily I managed to escape the spell and yeah honestly having a higher spellbook level probably won me the game sometimes you just need to be honest yeah I have a high sp uh, high spellbook level and it can win you games it is what it is so um, 
yeah that's it it may be the last season push video probably um, because yeah the next season starts in two days um, I hope you liked it so if you like it feel free to leave a like subscribe and if you want to watch more <laughs> I don't know what should I say <laughs> if you already subscribed and liked and uh, posted a comment on the video I'm happy about it okay See you on the next video. Bye-bye, guys.